Hey everyone, QB King 77 here from the AC Syndicate team here to do a video showing you how to enable the new way to search on Google on your mobile phone using Handwrite from Google. Um, actually, it's a very it's a pretty neat feature. Actually, you can use it on any uh, touchscreen device. It doesn't have to be an Android phone. It can be an iPhone as well or a tablet. Uh, but what all you have to do is go ahead and go to your internet browser on your device and then go to Google.com. So type in google.com, load it on up. Now, uh, once you're in google.com, you will scroll down and you will see settings down at the bottom. You'll see a button where it says settings. Go ahead and press that, press that button. And in your settings, you will see a handwrite option. Go ahead and press enable. Scroll down and hit save. And that's gonna go ahead and enable it for you. And now what you can do is actually reload this google.com page. And once you reload it, down in the bottom right, you will see um, this icon show up, this G. Uh, this cursive G right there, you'll see that load up, which is basically letting you know that uh, it has been enabled. When you tap it, it actually uh, opens up, and now you can basically write anywhere on the screen. So let's say you wanted to search for, let's say, Android. So we can say A-N-D-R-O-I-D. -D. So we write Android on our screen, and it uh, basically says Android, and then you can hit search, and there you have it. So using basically my finger and writing, I did a quick Google search for Android. Um, and actually, let me go ahead and go forward. I didn't mean to hit back. So let's go ahead and go forward again. And while you're on this Android screen, I think you can hit it again and either continue and actually continue this. So Android tab. So if we search Android tab, it basically does it for us. I don't know why it didn't put a space. Oh, there's a space bar down here. It doesn't automatically put spaces, so you have to hit space there and then finish what you want to. So uh, again, I mean, this button down here basically allows you to do so. It, as I said, it should work on any mobile device, so you're definitely gonna have to share this with family and friends. Let them know they can try out this uh, pretty cool feature. I mean, you can do squiggles. It's, it's, it tries to uh, basically do it. You can do some smiley faces. Um, yeah, but you can have fun with it. Uh, I mean, it doesn't have to be just some serious thing. If you're on the go and you want to just basically press this button down here, you can actually still, even while it's on, you can tap right here and it brings up the keyboard for you. So if you just want to use the keyboard as opposed to that, or obviously you don't have to enable this if you don't want to. Just figured I'd do a quick review of it and just basically let's, let's go ahead and try another one. So let's say I want to do a search for golf courses. So G-O-L-F and underneath it, I'm going to start typing courses. Sorry for the poor handwriting. You'll see, my handwriting's terrible and it's still getting it. So, I mean, golf courses right there, hit search, does a Google search for golf courses, and there we have it. Awesome. So, another very uh, neat feature included, courtesy of Google, of course. Um, I mean, you'll definitely have to try it out. Let me know how it works for you guys, if it can transcribe your chicken scratch or not. Uh, so, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this. If you think it's just a novelty feature, if it's something you're actually going to use, just press that button and do a quick search. Uh, so, let me know. Leave a comment. Be sure to subscribe as well. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+. All links will be in the description of the video below. As always, thanks for watching.